The Tucson Sunrise Rotary Club is putting on a night of nostalgia to support a unique Tucson Community Resource Center called Higher Ground. Jansen Azarias and Ann Marsh Martin are here with all of the details. You guys, thank you so much for coming. Yes, our pleasure. Thank you for having us. Oh, absolutely. Now, let's actually talk about the event a little bit and why mm -hmm. this event is so important. Um, because we're supporting higher ground. Yeah. Uh, Tucson Sunrise Rotary is putting on our spring fundraiser, which is called Night of Nostalgia, and it's a night of 50s, 60s, and 70s rock music. Uh, one of the members of our club has a band called on No Reply, and it will be great fun. It'll be at the Whistle Stop Depot, which is a really fun place down on Fifth Street by the tracks. It's amazing. It's all reclaimed architecture. And we're having the event on Friday, the 24th of March from 6 till 10. Great fun, food, drinks included, two of them, um, <laughs> and uh, great entertainment and partly tax deductible. And you would be supporting one of the finest things in town. Well, and before we hear a little bit more about um, Higher Grounds, kind of tell me a little bit about the Rotary. Um, Rotary was founded in, 9, 000, in uh, 1905, uh -huh. and it is a an international service organization that has about 1.2 million people around the world in all the free countries and over 200 countries and there are about 33,000 clubs and our object is to our motto is service above self and we serve humanity from anywhere but like a park bench in a in a park to eradicating polio from the world which is our project that is supposed to be finished pretty soon only three cases left in the wow. world well yeah. rotary is, is a name like you said is synonymous with helping right um, and we're gonna find out why we've chosen higher ground tell me a little bit more about higher ground um, higher ground is a youth development center that um, really started in my living room about 10 11 <laughs> years ago um, because of my wife and my son um, and it's grown to be um, a social emotional learning place. Um, so we have a um, bunch of programs. We have um, our after school program that has about 150 kids. Um, and then we have in school programming for kids who have um, some behavior needs and some academic needs. Um, you know, we offer a lot of the support through um, Jiu Jitsu, Judo, dance, boxing, music, art, um, some academic um, tutoring. Um, and then we work with the teachers in their schools, um, especially in the community of South Tucson is where we're located. So on the average, we serve about 700 kids um, and uh, we believe in the theory of an inch wide but a mile deep. So we work with the kids in everything. Um, we mentor them, we coach them, um, and then we're there meeting with the teachers, meeting with the principals, meeting with um, everybody who's involved in their life, supporting their families as well, and um, integrating ourselves into the child's community is the whole idea. And so how did that uh, make you feel when you found out that the Rotary decided that you would be the beneficiary for their event? We've always loved Rotary Club. In fact, in our um, student handbook, um, we have the Rotary Club's um, four-way test integrated in there. Um, you know, I love the whole mission of service above self. Um, what we've done at Higher Ground is we've redefined success from individual achievement to community contribution. So one of the things that we teach the kids um, once they hit middle school and high school is that you're no longer here just to take, but you're also here to give back. So at around four o'clock in the after school program, You'll see our entire front desk um, ran by students, yeah. our um, security ran by students. So we've always um, fallen in love with Rotary Club. We've sent our students to the RILA, to their leadership camps, um, and so we've we've been extremely thankful and grateful that we're one of the beneficiaries for an organization that for us represents what our students want to yeah. become. Well, great role models for those students, uh, helping one another, um, doing a collaboration that's in the end going to definitely help those students in our community. I'm going to remind them again the details okay. of that event. Thank, but you. thank you both so much for coming here today. Thank you. Thank you. Now, you are invited to Night of Nostalgia on March 24th from 6 to 10 p.m. at the Whistle Stop Depot. To learn more, visit higherground.me or tucsonsunriserotary.org.